love the summer but are stuck for ideas when it comes to celebrating the season, then fear not. This series is all about making the most of the sun in your garden with food and decor that's on trend and on budget as we show you how to make it yourself. Summertime is upon us and it's time to freshen up our homes and welcome in the new season. We're going to show you how to throw an old style garden party with a modern twist. I'll be in the kitchen preparing some suitably stylish dishes that will really impress your garden guests. And I'll be showing you how to style your party for a romantic setting that will take you back in time. Just because vintage is our theme, it doesn't have to do with food. So I'm going to go for a classic English rare beef salad, but with a bit of a twist. So, to begin with, I've got some really beautiful fillet steak here. Now, I'm just going to season that with some salt and pepper. And then I'm going to sear it in a really hot pan. Because I love steak really, really rare, I actually almost want it quite raw in the middle. You can cook it to however you like, but you really do want to have this quite pink. And I'm literally just going to sear this for about 20 to 30 seconds on each side. I'm going to just carve it on a slight angle and going to carve it as thin as I possibly can. So then it's just a matter of laying this onto a platter. So then it's about making the dressing and it really couldn't be easier. This is some wasabi paste, which is the green paste you get with your sushi. And it's basically a cross between horseradish and mustard. It really gets up your nose, but it is so delicious. Then I've got some ginger here, which I'm going to grate. Now I'm going to whisk in some rice wine vinegar, which is just an Asian vinegar, and it's just really tart, but it's got some sweetness to it as well. It's super delicious. Some soy sauce. And then we just whisk it together. Now I'm just going to dress um, the beef with half of this dressing. Then it's just a matter of getting all of our veggies ready. So I've got some radishes here, some purple and pink ones. Now, onto the tomatoes, same thing. It's the summertime, you've got yellow and red tomatoes. Now the spring onions. And then we've got one of these guys, it's a white radish. I'm just gonna take a, an end piece off and cut this into matchsticks. Beautiful watercress. Then some chives. And last, some sesame seeds. They just look beautiful. I'm just putting the last of my dressing on. And there we have it. A stunning salad for a stunning summer party. When it's really hot outside, it's really important to keep your guests refreshed. Now, there's no better recipe for that than my crab cakes. If you just get some really fresh crab from your fishmonger and get them to pick it for you, you end up with this gorgeous meat. It's really, really sweet. So I'm just going to put this into a bowl, along with some fresh white breadcrumbs, an egg yolk, a tablespoon of mayonnaise, a tablespoon of Worcestershire sauce, a teaspoon of mustard, then a few dashes of Tabasco. Then into that, I'm going to zest a lemon. Then just squeeze in the juice of half of it. Bring onions. I'm just going to chop them up really fine. And then finally, some parsley. And then, hands in there, give it a good squidge together. So then all you need to do is shape it into discs. Now it's just a matter of frying them for a couple of minutes on each side. So I'm going to take these out now, so I hope Danielle's ready for me. 